Part 11 of Awesome Powder Coat's Engine Tin Installation Guide. Now we're going to install the thermostat flat linkage. Here's the different parts we're going to be talking about. You've got a German thermostat and bracket and a brand new VW Mexico thermostat and bracket. You can see the obvious differences. On the German one, you should have about a quarter inch gap between the thermostat and the top of the bracket. Uh, old ones that are no good will be fully expanded. You can test that by putting them in hot water. This is the uh, one two cylinder side heater box, lower piece of sled work. We've got a return spring. We've got three different linkages. The early internal oil cooler linkage is strictly just basically a flat bar. The doghouse oil cooler thermostat flat takes, there's a special modified bar with larger offset to go around the doghouse. And the last years had a three-piece unit where you've got these two little short sections and then this bar. All of which are installed with uh, washers and either a combination of some small springs, a retainer clip, or what I use is some nylon spacers and 732nd inch E-clips, all of which are installed just using needle nose pliers. On the thermostat flaps, you want to make sure that the four, fla four flaps move easily. Now in this case, I'm going to be installing this linkage here. Just fit it up behind here. Get the little bars lined up on one side. Get the bars lined up on the other. Make sure it works. In this case, where I'm using some nylon spacers and E clips, almost you can push them on with needle nose, or in this case, just push them on by hand. And then you want to make sure everything moves nice and easy. If you're buying these E-clips, you probably want to buy a couple extra because they're relatively inexpensive and odds are you're going to drop one and lose it. There. Just like that. The later doghouse, very similar except you have this, this piece would go on both sides and then this linkage would attach on both sides like that. Otherwise, the same. That's done. Now we can hook up the thermostat. Install the thermostat. Thermostat. Now we're ready to install the thermostat. There's two different styles. You've got the German VW thermostat and the new VW Mexico thermostat. If your thermostat German one doesn't have a gap here, it's no good. Uh, the brackets install the same. It's just the uh, bolts to the engine right here, like that. It's made to be adjustable up and down. To install the thermostat, it's pretty straightforward. You just screw this in into the rod now at this point you'll have to adjust how far on you have the screw and when you get that adjusted right it'll just pop into this bracket and you can put a nut on here and you can adjust it up and down to get the right amount of travel how to do that covered in the factory service manual. Once that's all on, then you can install the lower heater box sled. It goes right here. It's a screw here and a screw here and a screw here. 